sit back and enjoy. Welcome to my channel. Good morning. We are still on good morning, even though you could be watching this in the evening. Though it don't really matter what time you think it is, or what time it is. I don't care anyway. Been in a filthy mood for the last few days. Utterly filthy. Wanting to top myself. Oh, terrible. Terrible, terrible. And I always take the piss out of myself, so that doesn't help, because it makes it look as if I've just been fucking around. But, I've had a shit time. <laughs> I do find that when I'm like this, it's best to use humour to cheer yourself up. But apart from with the dog, who if he carries on doing that, I will have to do something drastic. Don't pretend you can't hear me, David. He's getting fed up because all I do is have a go at him. I'm sorry. He's had a couple of chews today to apologise, but he's not having any of it. He's just fed up with me because he keeps shouting at him because he keeps being itchy. I'm sorry, Dave. He's not even talking to me now. Filthy mood. Um, So it would have been the best time to go and have my bloods taken. But I can't just walk in anymore to have my bloods taken. I've got to make an appointment and I can't be fucked to make an appointment. <sighs> so that's fucked that up. So that's stupid. Everything's changed. And then I'm fed up about everything. Fed up about everybody. People are fucking me off. <sighs> can't be bothered. That's it. The all and end all. Um, everyone keeps saying, oh, well, you've got it better than some. I like, oh, fuck off. <sighs> People just haven't got any empathy or any um, knowledge of the situation. That's why they think I've got it better than some. Some people could have cancer. I'd fucking love to have it because then I can see the end much better and sit here being fucking... having to have everybody... Wait around on me. Well, I don't want it. I wouldn't do it myself. Oh, you can't be saying things like that. Well, I can, actually. I can't go out. Oh, I'm fucking moaning. I haven't stopped moaning. I'm either moaning, crying, shouting at the fucking dog. David, stop scratching. I can't take the dog to the fucking vets. And then when I do take him to the vets, he's on tablets for his scratching, and then I keep forgetting to give him to him. <sighs> he's had his walk this morning, so he knows he's not going out again, so he's fed up. We have had a bit of a play in the garden, and he came in muddy. But it wasn't your fault that he came in muddy. It's just that you're having a nice time in the garden. <sighs> I'm itchy. Moaning. <sighs> that fucking thing on the front door. I'm hyper alert to everything, and my other side of my letterbox keeps flapping because it's very, very windy. And I came down at three o'clock in the morning, um, and I blue tacked it shut, went back upstairs again, and it started again. And it's the fucking other side. And I was not going outside at three o'clock in the morning. <sighs> so I didn't sleep. Then I had Kevin jump on top of me and then Gary jump on top of me. They're my cats. And then Rodney, who's the other cat. Oh, God. <sighs> yeah, so I need to do something to sort my life out, change everything and work things out. I don't know what to do. Because otherwise, I'm going to be sat here. Oh, but I can't fucking do anything because my head starts hurting. Oh, I don't know, I have to think about it. Anyway, I've been run over. I've made me feel no better. But it's let you look, figure out what's going on. <laughs> Not a lot. 
I don't care, really. Fucker. <laughs> Oh, I did wash Dave's bandana though, and it looks beautiful. So that was a good thing. He's not going to look near him to put it on there. Alright, I'll speak to you later. Over and out. Thank you.